What's good, Canes fans? It's your boy, the host of one, Holloway, representing the U family. Back again to give you the best content on YouTube when it comes to this U. So today, March 19th, the first day of spring practice under the Manny Diaz era. So we were already super excited about what today would bring. But not only did today bring the opening of football here at the U for the first time in a while since that debacle against Wisconsin, we got some of the best information that we have been waiting months and months on. Tate Martell is officially eligible for the 2019 season. And you can hear the excitement in my voice and the excitement around the Miami Hurricane Nation family right now. We are elated because now it is every single man, every single man in this race. Nikosi Perry, Jaron Williams, Tate Martell are all healthy, all eligible and ready to give 1000 percent to see who the man to lead this Miami Hurricanes team will be. Who will earn the right to be the quarterback at the U? Which one is it? There's no preconceived notions. There is the people who recruited them are not on the roster. They're no longer coaches there. So these are clean slate men, coaches, actual coaches, an actual quarterbacks coach who played Division I football at Michigan State, was the head coach at Central Michigan, was the offensive coordinator at Arkansas, was going to be the offensive coordinator at Alabama. Now he's the OC at the U. So he has a track record in Dan Enos. So he will be able to actually coach these three young men and bring the potential out of them. What we have been waiting on is here. Who's going to take the playbook seriously? Who's going to take on the field and off the field seriously? Who's taking the weight room seriously? Who's going to live up to us? Because we used to be known as QBU. Who is going to live up to the standard? We talk about the new Miami. This is it right here. The defense has already lived up to the expectation and set new precedent. Is the offense going to do the same? And now the NCAA gave the U a W. We finally got a W against these people. This doesn't make up for that Ohio State, uh, you know, flag. But we got a W against the NCAA for the first time. It took too long, but it's just enough time for this young man to have a fair shot at winning this. And win, lose, or draw is fair. If he loses it, it's a fair choice because he's eligible with enough time to get the playbook down, go through spring practice with everybody, and see who wins the battle. Jaron Williams, Nikosi Perry, and now Tate Martell. Who is going to step up and take this thing. Who's going to take it? Who wants to host a national championship and say, I am the man that brought the University of Miami back to national relevance? Who is it going to be? Thank you for tuning in to this quick video. The wholesome one, Holloway, representing the U family. And make sure you tell your lovers and your haters that you love them and that there is nothing that they can do about it always being about this you.